Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back to another video. Blue here. Table. Right, something right. You already watched it. Let's watch a different one. Let's go to sleep. In case we need to rest the fire next big target. Sleep. Sleep. Look, like, feel like I have indigestion. Did I eat anything strange there? Indigestion. Indigestion? What? Were you watching the broadcast? So the fan things were the bad guys? Now that you mention it, I felt that way the whole time. It's just brainwashing, isn't it? It's really self-centered. <laughs> Saturday. Did you catch that student detective on television yesterday? Oh, and that talk show is simply dreadful. How can anyone seriously suggest the supernatural beings are stealing people's hearts? That child is phony. There's simply no way that Phantom Thieves exists. Unfortunately, my previous children all think they're real and worse that the, this detective is amazing. Children are far too impressionable to see such vulgar content on TV. Was that people still don't think we're real? Let's bring back that DVD as well. We need to bring the DVD back before we get charged. I'm so pumped. I can't believe we were on TV yesterday with Akechi Kun. It was like a dream come true. Can't believe the high schooler Moonlights has a detective. He's just like the detective prince. He's smart and handsome. He's almost too perfect. We had front row seats. I could practically reach out and touch a catchy sign. Couldn't. I was so nervous. He was working really, working that uniform and without seeming like a snob, he's a natural at public speaking. Now he's, a, he's an orphan who grew up poor. His main part of the, his part of what makes him so amazing. He wants his high school memory to be capturing the fan thieves. This isn't, isn't a game to him. See, I heard his dad, the head of some big financial conglomerate. I will say, I love that he hates the media. Makes me believe that he doesn't do this for the fame. People say he's so good that he's made enemies in the police force. Oh yeah. Apparently, yesterday's interview was so popular they've they're not going to air it again today. One morning, morning. <sighs> I just remembered. You're back. You finished your homework. Nice. That was quick. That was uh, pretty quick. <clears throat> I've seen a lot of shows on TV lately about these phantom thieves of hearts. <sighs> Why someone would steal something like a heart which can't be turned into money is beyond me. If I were a phantom thief, I wouldn't go after hearts. Or works of art. I go after gold. The value of gold has been high since ancient times, and there has never been a more stable resource. You. Now then, blue sun. Imagine how how much gold has been evacuated by humanity over the course of history. Three pools, goddamn it. Surprisingly little, don't you think? That rarity is what drives its value. God damn, we got that wrong. Shit. Did the teacher mean to pick someone else? There have definitely there are definitely people who have gotten that right. 
Incidentally, they say that 60% of the world's gold is in J Japan. Was that your first time to two get Tokugawa clans buried gold? It's actually discarded home electronics. In other words, a junkyard is much more valuable than someone else's heart. What did you say? Mm, can't measure the value of a treasure with money. Lunch time. Man, the detective from yesterday really pissed me off. Or some kind of threat? Let's see him do it then. If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. Ow. You're being way too loud. Be way too loud. Who cares? Everybody's talking about this stuff, anyways. They'd just be more suspicious if we were whispering. <sighs> hey, you're really just gonna keep eating and eating and eating those things all by yourself? Give me some. It was, it's snowing now. It's snowing now, right there. Does it snow in Italy? Does it snow in Italy? Because it's snowing here. I shoveled the driveway a little bit. Sorry, just ate the last one. Just ate the last one. What the hell is she eating? You guys are too laid back. The police are getting involved now, you know. So you think it's true? We'll be okay if we keep doing this, right? We'll be okay. We can't let the cops scare us out of being phantom thieves. But what about that weird guy from Madarame's palace? Isn't there a lot we don't know? The hell? Taking pictures? You three seem to be having so much fun. I'm a little jealous. Here's the student council president. Snooping on us again? I said before, we don't know nothing. Why do you think I'm here to question you? Could it be that you're hiding something? My ears are always open to the troubles of my peers, you know. You're really that hungry for a good letter of recommendation? Of course you are. Nobody would take on your annoying job if they weren't. What's that supposed to mean? You're student council president, right? Wouldn't you have known about Kamoshida? Of course not. He honestly was a good teacher until that day. Oh, but you always take the teacher's side. That's what a good council president does, right? Then how about you? What did you do for your friend? You were much closer to her than I was. So how did you help? There wasn't any way to help! By myself, I couldn't do anything for her. There's no need to shout. If those phantom thieves are out there helping people, I'd root for them, no questions asked. Gotta be more dependable than some people I know. Just make sure you show up to your classes, all right? You know what I asked earlier about whether we'll be okay if we keep this up? I take it back. I'd be ashamed to let it end now. Sure. Hell yeah. It's about time we find our next target, too. Let's find our next target. Who's our next target gonna be? Who's our next target gonna be? Only I could. Comments are coming in at an alarming rate. 
negative one seems to be more prominent. Hey, Smurfs average, what up, man? A criminal group with unknown goals that does whatever it wants in the name of justice. Huh. It's probably because of Akechi. TV's got some crazy sway. He's free to deny our actions, but being cursed by his influence is another thing entirely. Just when we were starting to get people to believe in us, too. All we gotta do is take down another hotshot, yeah? It's going good, it's going good. Well, do you have any ideas who this next hotshot could be? I ain't got a thing yet. Damn it, this is real irritating. By the way, what's up with that luggage? Oh, I decided to leave the school dorms. You are not only filthy, but too noisy as well. No true art would come from such a place. No true art can come from such a place? He's moving out? Yusuke's moving out? What are you gonna do then? You can't go back to that shack, right? I was planning on staying at Takamaki-san's. I mean, aunt's house. I've even prepared a thank you gift. I hope it's to your parents' liking. The game is like 100 hours to beat. I'm only on hour 20. I've even prepared a thank you gift. I hope it's to your parents' liking. Yeah, 100 hours. You're the impossible one. But I spent everything I had on these delectable Japanese sweets. The spell was money. That's not the issue here. Seriously, though, what are we going to do about him? Manga Cafe. I don't have the money. Does it have the money? Then why'd you leave? Well, seeing as Yusuke is an important member of our team, I'll lend a hand. Come stay at our place. It's dirty, but at least you'll have somewhere to sleep. Why are you the one calling the shots? Don't you two live in a cafe? I've been wondering about that for a while. Yeah, we live in LeBlanc's cafe. Yonkin's not too far, is it? It's not that far, it's not that far. Nope. And the cafe is only a minute walk from the station. How about we go there now? Go there now? We can have a party to celebrate Madarame's change of heart. Oh, good idea. We can make it a welcome party for Yusuke, too. A welcome party for Yusuke? Let's go to LeBlanc's Cafe. All right, it's decided. Let's go to the cafe. LeBlanc's Cafe. All right, it's decided. Sorry to cause you trouble. Sorry to cause you trouble. By the way, I prefer sleeping on a futon. Futon? Nice. He's come to our house, I guess. It'll be up to you to or cafe. He's come to move in with us at the cafe, that's nice. It'll be up to you to defense the chat to Chief. What a nice smell. This is their first time here at the cafe. It's nice. This place looks so outdated. Can't say I hate it though. People refer to that as retro. Retro? Mm. Who are they? Hello. A girl, too? This guy has really helped us a lot lately. <laughs> I bet you're the ones doing all the helping. No, really. He's been great. Huh. 
Soldro, our boy, our our chief. He's the chief, I guess. Sit down. This round will be on the house. This round will be on the house. You're helping, though. Hmm. Indeed. There's great depth to its acidity. Oh yeah, I remember now. I think I've seen LeBlanc mentioned in a magazine before. <laughs> that was a long time ago. For real? Oh, oh give me a taste. Get a taste, Ryuji. Ryuji. Oh shit, there's a lot of people in here. What? Give me a double double. Ah, it's so bitter. Oh, this has gotta be cruel and unusual punishment. One sweetener, two milk, or double double, whatever one. <laughs> I didn't drink coffee when I was a kid either. These are your friends, yeah? Go on and take them up to your room. No need to stay down here. Ooh, I wanna see. So we're gonna check out our room. It's only an attic. Attic. That's where we live though, that's where we live. Oh man. Ah, that bitter taste just won't leave my mouth. Thank you very much for the drink. Up these stairs. Oh, and uh, thanks for the soda. Thanks for the soda. No problem, dude. No problem. So you're a. Uh... On. On Takamaki. Takamaki? On chan, huh? It's a nice name. You got a boyfriend? Nope. Never have either. Hey, you gotta get up here. This place is freaking insane. Place is insane. Ryuji's happy to see my plates. Go on. Oh right. Thank you for the coffee. No problem. Soldier loves his coffee. They had to leave the Mona bag down here. Hmm. Sweet girl. Let's check out our room, our attic. This is their first time seeing my attic. What do you think of this room? I don't know where to begin. It seems quite ordinary to me. For real? Oh. See? A ain't this crazy? It's cleaner than I thought it would be. What? Well, sit wherever you'd like. Sit wherever you'd like. We're all over the news. We're all over the news. Even those who previously believed in us have been influenced by the comments made on TV. This is all that effing Akechi's fault! Keep it down. We don't want anyone hearing us. At this rate, we're just going to worry everyone instead of give them courage. Check out our TV over there, our TV. I guess Yusuke's staying at our place now. I guess Yusuke's staying at our house, our cafe, attic of okay, cafe. I guess he's staying at the attic of the cafe, that's nice. We need to find a way to make our rightfulness known to society. It's time we think about our next move. You were planning on discussing that today, right? Yes. First, we need to search for a candidate. Search for a candidate? It's not like we're just gonna stumble upon some important target, though. You guys don't know anyone, do you? I have no idea. I don't. Me neither. I have no idea. 